My name is Parker Roberts. I'm 23 years old. My full-time occupation is as an administrative assistant for the U.S. federal government in Department of Homeland Security's Customs and Border Protection Nexus Office. It's a customer service administrative support position, and I do that five days a week. But on TV, I play Chip Roberts, 17-year-old, pseudo-androgynous, 80s abomination. Eight hours at work, not online, and then eight hours at home online. So Chip Roberts started out as pretty much a regular guy with rapid cell regeneration like Wolverine, and then over time turned into a absurd sort of 80s teenager with raging hormones. And I wanted to do a sort of review absurd show. Man, I'll bet those donkeys who invented the smart TV never would have predicted that I'd program it to have the 80s running on a loop. <laughs> Tell you what, sometimes I miss the simplicity of the old millennium. Back in those days, you just turn on a channel and let it ride. If you were a channel, I'd turn you off. It's no good to know. say that Chip is the completely unhinged id of Parker. Not everything I want to be, but everything I probably would be if I just stripped down all of society's norms. There's a lot of overlap within the character and within me. Like, if I could, I would paint my nails every day. I would probably dress like this or close to this every day. Um, and I... It's essentially Chip Roberts is the person who you sort of live vicariously through once or twice a week, and then you kind of get it all out of your system, so... Obviously the real me isn't going around doing ridiculous things or saying ridiculous things, but it's Chip Roberts is a confident, intelligent, and somewhat brash and unapologetic, you know, man, and I think that there's a lot of me in that, but a lot of me that you can't really do because you need to be a civilized human being. The end goal that you had in mind at first is less important because you enjoy doing it for different reasons. So ultimately the goal is always fame, or at least to be able to do it full time at some capacity and be compensated for it and have to live comfortably. Really what I would like to do is do it full time and to do the things that the other big YouTubers are doing.